first, though, making the headlines this morning. It is the new TV show, Tonight, that sees contestants stripping naked and being left to fend for themselves in the countryside. Wow. Well, fully clothed, Lily and Jenny from Naked Alone and Racing to Get Home join me now. Now, you two seem like sensible women. What on earth made you apply for this? <laughs> <laughs> Lily, tell me. Um, it was it was actually one of my friends that had applied and she said, I think you'd be a really good person to do it with. And it was just such a bizarre request, such a random challenge, something I didn't think I'd be doing at 40, getting your kit off on telly and doing a survival yeah, challenge. When an opportunity like that drops in your lap, you've just got to you say, say yes. You say no thanks, yeah. No, I'll, I'll no, just go and read you've a nice got book to in say yes. No, you chose to go naked on live TV. I did, I did, and I have no regrets. But the thing with your story <laughs> is kind of quite dramatic because, yes, your friend got you into this. Mm -hmm. What actually happened in the end? Who did you end up doing the show with and um, why? A stranger. A, st a stranger. He was a lovely chap. He's called Liam. He's from Australia. He's gone back. We're still in touch. Yes, but, yeah. but this wasn't the plan. You were meant to be doing it with your plan. friend. What yeah. happened? Two she, friends. She, yeah, she couldn't take part, um, like, wonderfully, she um, has had a baby, so she couldn't take part. And then, that was convenient. That's a convenient excuse, isn't it? I know. Excuse, I was it? like, really? Yes. But then, obviously, it, there was no... no so you ended up doing it. You were meant, this was meant to be you and a friend going mm -hmm. naked on TV together. In the end, you dropped in a field and there's a complete stranger stood there, a fella. Yeah. Awkward. Where'd you look? <laughs> Where'd you look? Oh, do you know what? The what naked you element you, what... very quickly goes out the window. I don't know about you, Jenny, but you, it's awkward the first time you de-gown and then you're just cold and looking for shelter. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> <laughs> Now, Jenny, this is a completely different story for you because you did it with your partner who you've been with for several years. Yes. Right. Yeah. Now, that could test any relationship. And it really did test your relationship, didn't it, doing this show together? It did, yes. So, when I agreed to do it, it was to support my partner. He teaches survival and he wanted this challenge to test himself. I agreed to it not actually believing we'd ever go through with it. <laughs> and then it kind of got to the point where I had no choice. So, you know, I just got on with it. But I've seen the first episode, which goes out tonight, and there's a bit of tension between the two of you because he goes off one way and you're sort of left fending for yourself. That's like a relationship-ending moment, isn't it? Like, hang on a minute, mate, I did it for you and now you've gone down that way. No, so it was something we did agree on. Um, I didn't expect to feel the pressure that I did once yes. he had gone off. Um, but, you know, I don't blame him for going off. We agreed it was going to be the best thing for our team for that challenge. You're a um, very understanding partner, <laughs> yeah. like I say. Yeah, no. But, but can I just say, like, there's loads of shows about sort of survival and, um, you know, racing across the country without your phone and trying mm. to do all this sort of stuff. But the naked bit, of course, is what's getting all the headlines. Why was that... Why isn't, isn't that just an exhibitionist bit? Why is it something else? Because... I mean, you don't seem like exhibitionists. You're quite shy, actually, aren't you? Which I, I find am. so strange. Yeah, so for me, like I said, I never actually thought we'd go through with it. And then it got to the point where there was no going back. So I just thought, you know, what the heck? Just take your clothes off. And as soon as they were off and everybody had seen me, you, you do forget about the fact yeah. you're naked and all you want to yes. do is survive. But what's funny is, because it's, it's set in the countryside, but eventually you've got to go into a town <laughs> where they're not expecting naked people to be wandering through the streets. What happened when that sort of moment approached? Um, I didn't go into a oh, town. You didn't go into no. a town? Did you go into a town? Yeah, so we went through a town with people, but by that point, I, I just didn't care. I just wanted to get home. <laughs> so I would have done anything to get home at that point. So, no, I wasn't oh, my by goodness. it at all. And, it, and, Lily, for you, you are a bit of an action hero. You love this sort... Like, you put yourself <laughs> through lots of difficult things. Tell us a bit about the other stuff you've done. Um, so, um, yeah, I've, I've done a boxing match. I'm a retired boxer with a 100% record. I did thank one. You. Yeah. yeah, thank you, thank you. So I did one fight just to see if I could and won that. I've done three peaks challenge, done a couple of marathons. I just, I just like a, an intense, let's see if you can do it. Yes. And it, like to pit my mind against my body, your body's incredible and it can do a lot more. It's your mind that's saying, no, you can't do it. You're going to yes. die. This is awful. It's... And it's, it's, it's kind of meditative for me and it's a beautiful chance to be in nature. I don't know too many other people that run about the Scottish Highlands and no kit on. So. No, I agree. <laughs> now, can I just say, the show goes out tonight, right? Mm. You make this decision to go on this show. You didn't think you'd get on, you did. Now, everybody you've ever known 
Oof. And everybody ever, you're ever going to know, any jobs you go for, anything, your friends, your family, your in-laws, everybody is going to see you in the buff this evening. Mm -hmm. How does that make you feel like? Because they're all going to get together and what normally if you're on TV, you go, everybody get together, we'll watch it. Yeah. Now, are you a bit shy about tonight? Like it going out? Mm. I was at first, but then I thought we've all got naked bodies underneath the clothes and I'm sure plenty of people walk around their houses naked, not caring who looks in the window, so I'm not really fussed anymore. Are you fine with everybody, you know, but are there yeah. people that you would hope won't watch it, like your dad or your brother or, you know, like other people not, that you think, oh, God, don't watch that? Yeah, not really for me. The people that would tune into that show are people that would respect and understand why we did it. And at the end of the day, the people that know and love me and know what I'm yes. about respect that. And pe strangers that might have a bad judgment on me, that no. it, doesn't, it doesn't bother me. No. I, Cleared it with work. I've cleared it with the people that matter. It with work. That yeah. would be the thing and, to do, wouldn't oh, it? That was awkward. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I bet and, it was. I'm yeah. just doing this show. What did they what? say when you said you were gonna? What? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they were like, Amazing. yeah. And uh, so for me, I'm just really proud of it. And just quickly, can we just show this? Something lovely happens, doesn't it, for Jenny it does. and you and your partner? I Instead of wait. testing your relationship, it brought you much closer together because. <gasps> oh, he went down on one knee. <laughs> it... Yeah. Oh, <laughs> lovely, lovely stuff. Great stuff. Thank you, both of you. It is Thank a really brave thing to do. Naked Alone and Racing to Get Home starts uh, at nine o'clock tonight on E4 and All 4. Thank you.